Hi, my name is Sarah Wilde and I'm the science editor at The Mail and Guardian. From particle physics to cosmology, we want to help you tell the country about your research. And that's why we started Science Voices, a program in which we train you to be published in The Mail and Guardian. You write an article about your field of research and myself and a group of judges will select 25 of those and work with the people who submitted them. You have to be registered at a South African institution for a master's or doctoral degree. If you are graduating this year in 2014, you are still eligible for Science Voices. You also have to be a South African or African passport holder. And most importantly, it has to be your own work. Plagiarists are most definitely not welcome. Number one, you need to think about your topic. You need to think about your research and you need to try and distill it into a phrase or paragraph and then expand on that. As your master's or doctoral supervisor has probably already told you, you should try and keep your focus as narrow as possible to try and fit it on a pinhead. And that also works in science writing. Number two, please don't email me personally for guidance, for hints, to give your draft a once over. I can't do that. It would prejudice other people who are also entering into Science Voices. Number three, we will be posting videos to help you to write for us. These will be things like Science Writing 101 and what we're looking for in the Science Voices project. Number four, the deadline for submissions for Science Voices is the 1st of June 2014. So you have time, don't panic. Rather think about your topic and distill it into something that will make me sit up and pay attention. Number five, please submit your entry using the online entry form on sciencevoices.mg.co.za. If you mail me directly, chances are very high that your submission will be lost in the flood that is my inbox. And number six, enjoy it. This is your chance to tell the country what you are doing. Thank you.